Hello guys and welcome to an all-new LP, Chrono Trigger. Chrono Trigger, I welcome thee to Chrono Trigger, an all-time favorite JRPG, or so I'm told. This is totally blind, so if you can't really dig that, then um, there's a lot of other people doing it, like uh, Nintendo Capri Sun, there's a guy called HCB... HC Bailey doing it, having done it, you know, I don't really know, I don't really watch them, but, you know, quick YouTube search reveals all the truths of the world, but if, if you want to go on, ad adve on an adventure with me, if I can speak properly, then, um, I invite you, so let's do it, that's the plan. mode we want to go with the you know I don't really like active mode so I'm gonna go with the wait mode because you know I, I want to take my time try not to die and then let's just call him something ridiculous let's not call him something ridiculous let's just have him called chrono let's keep the lore straight up Straight up and fantastical. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, adjust myself. We can do this. It's gonna get intense right off the bat. Or maybe not. Now I must, I must admit, I did play a little bit of this. Um... So if you've played it before and you're watching me and then you're gonna yell at me... Uh, or... Where am I going with this straight thought? No, I have played a little bit of this, uh, so... Really, there's... Chrono, Chrono... Good morning, Chrono! Come on, sleepyhead, get up! I don't want you. Ah, Lean's Bell makes such a beautiful music. You were so excited about the Millennial Fair that you didn't sleep well, did you? I want you to behave yourself today. I can't promise that, Mom. Let's get moving now. <laughs> the guy's so intense. Colonel, super intense. Let's, let's do that. You know, close to curtains. See, that's... In 95, they did this, you know? And, like, even games nowadays, they don't even bother with this... So trivial kind of stuff, you know? But it just adds to the atmosphere. And the music in this game. Blah. When I was walking around, you know, I was, like, in a, in a fucking forest. And I was just like, God, oh, this music, it speaks to me. Finally, by the way, that adventure friend of yours? Uh, you know, oh dear, I've forgotten her name. We shall call her Luca. Well, this game, it's, I'm running this on the EPSXE, and the loading time uh, between like these little sequences takes like an extra like five seconds, five to ten seconds, which is, I mean, a little annoying, but it's not necessarily. Nah. And I don't really have like a dazzle thingy or what of whatever, but bah, what other ever thingy that I can record from my TV or stuff like that. So I'm gonna have to live with it. That's right, Luca. Don't forget she invited you to see her new invention. Run along now and be back before dinner. Yeah. Hello, cat. Hello. Meow. Meow. Now, if I remember correctly, there's like nothing else to interact with. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's your allowance. Oh, well. <laughs> well, thank you. I didn't even. I didn't even know I could get that. Last time I didn't ask her. Ha! Ha! Oh, new advent. New experiences. Very good. Very good. So, like, basically what I did when I played for like 
those ten minutes is that I went into the forest, then I grind a little bit just fighting monsters just to see how it was, and I actually think that's a good idea. I'm gonna do that again. Maybe not for ten minutes, but just to do an all-around clearing. Because I did find something cool, I found. Just like this, yeah, there we go. I found that one last time. I remember stuff. Yeah. So between like these little sequences, it's gonna take like an extra two to seven seconds to load. Wait, I don't know why it 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 does that, but I mean, uh. but who cares, man? It's about the story. It's about the story. We don't care about loading times, unless they're totally... Unless they're like Sonic 06. Then we might care. Mm -hmm. If you don't know what I mean, just look up the Sonic from, like, uh, 2006. Infamous loading times. Also, I watched, um... Game Grumps, who, who are doing it. I, d I didn't have the game myself, by the way. It's a terrible game, just terrible game. But if you know who Game Grumps are, they're uh, basically Ego Raptor and JonTron YouTube, or YouTube for JonTron, Newgrounds for Ego Raptor, and they basically just teamed up and they're doing stuff, LPs. And they're a comedy duo. Very fun, very, very fun to watch. Very, uh,. Just stupid humor, which I enjoy a lot. But I think I'm just gonna level up here, get a little edge. I like edges, and you need that in JRPGs, especially old school ones. They're so they're so cruel. I don't know why, but they just are. But also, I can talk about this. What sparked my choice to do a JRPG? It's um, it's not that interesting, but I'll tell you anyway. It it basically comes down to. I feel like the JRPG genre has like died for me. It has just. It's just withered, you know. It's it. I can't play JRPGs anymore. They're just too fucking anime, and they're just, uh, and you know, just a children's anime of like stupidity and nonsense and, ugh. And those, you know, old school ones. They just, they're just so. Maybe, maybe I'm just looking through it with the, you know, rose-colored glasses, but they're just a lot more fun. And then, you know, I search a little on the web to, um, to come down with a good choice. And then I came across, I was gonna do either Sino Gears or Chrono Trigger. And I've played about five hours of Sino Gears. That was like maybe half a year ago. And, um, you know, oh, it's a good game. Uh, it's a little. It's a little mind fucky, but, but overall, it's a good game. But I ended up just choosing Chrono Trigger because that was apparently like the, the big cheese of them all. I'm fine with that. If I remember, yeah. Ooh. It's a mysterious box. If I remember correctly, we can't go to the castle because uh, we have to go to the fair. You know, that's how it is. Plot and all. They're all in my business. Just go to the fair, kid. You can't go to the castle. Man, those adults. Damn those adults for wanting me to progress the plot. 
You know, I'm really also just so... When I, when I play games like these from, you know, just 20 years ago... I'm just... Just so astounded by how much, like, we've progressed as a, you know, with games. Because I've seen Flash games that look just as good, if not better, than, you know, this game. And it's just... It's very astounding. Oh! Oh! Well, I fucked up, didn't I? <sighs> but that's just, just a very cool thought, that people can now just pick up whatever Flash or other programming tools and just, you know, just chug out one of these games or these kind of games, not necessarily with the masterpiece story or anything like that, but just, you know, it's a, it's something that crossed my mind. Very strange monsters. Hitake! Boop! Maybe I can set up the battle speed a little bit. I don't know. Alright! That's like two levels. We are excellent! Go! I do like exploring around a little bit before we are gonna. before we go to the Millennial Fair. That's just how I roll. I'm opening a stall at the fairgrounds. Why don't you drop by? Alright, everyone, let's have some fun. Going to the fair. Yeah! Festival! Let's get crazy! You're just a kid! A, fe a festival. Oh my god, it's Attack of the Clones! <laughs> Going to the fair. Alright everyone, let's have some... Uh, all of them are clones! No! <laughs> it's an army. But that's horrible. That's horrible, man. I'd be scared shitless. I don't believe there's anything more than this little city right here. There's also a tool... What's it called? I think it's called like VX... Something... It's like a... It's like a game to make these JRPGs, basically. VX... Man, it's the, t the title of the program is escaping me. Ah, uh, no, no, I'm trapped. Oh, oh, no. mm, yes, <laughs> I got out. Ha! I run this town, and I'm so rich I don't know what to do with it all. Give you ten gold if you act like a chicken. <laughs> I, I. I have no, you know, no pride. I'll act like a chicken for 10 gold. Haha, -ha, here you go, 10 gold. Yes! Dad loves money more than he loves me. Oh. The person I hate the most? My dad, of course. Why would Chrono go in here and just ask, ask her if... Who do you hate the most? Yeah, my dad, yeah. Out of everyone in your family, who do you hate the most? Everyone says daddy's greedy. They're lying, right? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, but there's another. I need a special charm. That's what I need. Or a key. It's probably plot related. Whee! And oh, there's a there's a ship. Can't do nothing with that. 
Snail stop. Mm. Some monsters coexist with humans, like that piano player. Four hundred years ago, a woman named Fiona died trying to save the great forest that once flourished to the north. How sad. I've got the best jerky in town, but I'm saving it. I might let some go for, say, 9,900 gold. How about it? Mm, how about not? I don't have that much money. Everyone's over at the festival. What fools? Fools! I'm the piano man. Something a beat or something sad. Play a sad one, Joe. Oh yeah. That's definitely sad. But it's hopeful. Ah. Yes. Can you feel it? Oh, that's emotional. <laughs> and then suddenly it stopped. Twenty gold in advance. Ah, uh, no. Come again soon. Ha ha. Maybe. But what I garnered from the intro of this game is um, time travel. <laughs> That is the- oh, no, oh, I play- press triangle. Damn it. Damn myself. But time travel seems to be the prevalent, uh... Seems to be the story here. Go to the past, go to the future, and... The present. I mean, all those are gonna be involved in some kind of way. It's kind of weird that he doesn't note anything when you try to interact with the environment. That happens sometimes. Lara. Oh, hi, Chrono. Lucas off at Lean Square with her father, Taban, unveiling her new invention. Okay. I know it's kind of for introductions purposes, but like, uh, the mother is just like her father, Taban. You know, that guy, that you're supposed to know because you've known Luca because she's a childhood friend. I can't close her curtains? What is this? Man. I call cheating. Uh, nothing else going on here, no, no. I guess not. What other places are to explore and get some backstory on this whole towny thingy? Hi! Do you know about our establishment? I should, considering that I've lived in this town for like a while, I guess, but I... No, this is the mayor's education center. Think of it as a beginner's workshop. You can take things you find here. You can take the things you find here. All right. Need a brief weapons and item seminar? No. No, I know. Got one tonic. Scattered throughout this world are places where you can save your game. Save whenever you can, especially in unfamiliar and dangerous areas. Ha ha! Wait, is that the save point? Yes. I'll save. Uh, if I know how, is this the save? Oh, I hope I have my memory card active. I hope I. Oh, that'd be bad. <laughs> battle mode, wait. Uh, save menu cursor. Save battle cursor. Battle message. 
Wait, is that that's slow and that's fast? Right? Yeah. Ah, okay. Let's let's roll with that. Let's try it out. Maybe something good can come from this. I exit. Still getting familiar familiarized with the controls. Uh, all right. Well, I I need to find out how to save. That's important if you want to stop playing. All right. I'll teach you all about skills. I'm not willing to learn. If that. Uh, 100 gold. Woohoo. Want my advice? Sure. You've got potential. You'll learn a number of techniques as you progress. Techniques are magic attacks that also utilize your weapons. You'll acquire them with discipline. Hold down the L1 and R1 buttons to escape from battle. Know when to run, but you need to fight to grow strong. Now, about the equip menu. No one cares. No one cares. No one cares. Stop! Alright, that seems about... Yeah. All that we need to know about a JRPG. From the 90s. And maybe early 2000s. Open chests, defeat monsters, you're good. <laughs> we haven't had much innovation. Ba -da -ba -ba. It's a residence. Haha, -ha. maybe there's something I can steal. That brat Lucas says she's made the discovery of a lifetime. I'm so happy I could scream! Hmm. These guys seem like walking cardboards with like little messages on their chests. I'm so happy I could scream. That Luca. She said something about a discovery. Hard to believe Guardia is now 1,000 years old and our king is the uh, 33rd descendant to the throne. But how can he rule a kingdom when he can't even control his own daughter? I don't know. Maybe his administrative prowess doesn't, you know, doesn't come into controlling daughters. Welcome to the Millennial Fair. Have fun. I shall. Wait, wait. Hello? Hello? I can't have fun. Those runners are busy raising, so they won't talk to you. What? That's very rude. Hello? Oh. There's a tonic, there's a revive, a shelter. Oh. Oh, that's a. I can totally use a lot of those. Aha! Yeah, we're, we're getting a head start. I've been preparing myself for this LP for, for forever. For a long time. Last time I did horribly. But now, I'm gonna do great. There's a bronze elm, karate key, armor. I guess there's a weapons vendor here somewhere. I heard Luca and her dad have made another crazy invention. I hope it doesn't blow up like all the others. Well, it'd be a spectacle. This is Lean's Square. They say people who hear Lean's bell ring will have interesting and happy lives. Oh, I had to talk to you already. I heard this guy pays big bucks for charms, weapons, and pendants, and other rarities. Buy something from Melquire, the swordsmith? Sure! Sure I will. New weapons are always good. The load sword. How much farming do you need to do to get that? Jeez. A lot. 
wait. Hmm. Yeah, why not? Ah. I need to go all the way out and then equip it. I live on the continent to the east. Come see me sometime. Sure. Last round's a winner. Cadillac. Guess the winner? Sure. Steel Runner, Green Ambler, Cadillac, GI Jogger. You can't go wrong with a name like that. Go. <laughs> run! GI Jogger, run! 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 Ah! Wait, are you the wrong guy? The green ambler, he sucks. Huh. Oh! Shit, I won! Fucking G.I. Jogger, man. He's a he's the man. Don't you mess with him. He knows what's up. Uh, let's get the iron blade. And then we can sell it. Our wooden sword. Man, maybe we can equip ourselves with a whole gear set. Now that would just be amazing. Ah, 50 gold. Well, so much for that. They both give the same, so I'll just get the bronze helm. Wait, maybe if I sell my other helm... Oh... Wait, do I have a helmet? Hmm... Maybe not. I do. Doo, 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 doo. It's probably only worth like 20. Ah, oh, no, 25. Damn. So close. Sadness. Oh well. I can live with it. The kingdom's been through a lot. Like the war with against Magus, Majors, like 400 years ago. Thank goodness things are so peaceful now. Right. That's not a setup to something bad's gonna happen. Uh, press the X button while facing the bell, judge your distance carefully, and press the O button. Yeah! Wait, really? Ah, you can do it over again. Ah, now I'm just getting worse. Ah, well, okay. You can only win that once. I'll accept that. <laughs> accept that as a fact. Um, I knew it. It's the Green Ambler. Yes. Oh, G.I. Jogger, man, he's a, he's a boss. He knows what's up. This is the renowned Tent of Horror. Spend your 21 silver points here. Parental discretion advised. I don't know. What's the big deal? So what if we won a war against wizard hundreds of years ago? I don't, I, I don't. Well. Hello? Oh, I, oh, okay. Hey! Ouch, that hurt. I'm so sorry, are you okay? Uh-oh, my pendant. Oh, oh no. Hello? Oh no, don't tell me I lost it. How did it, how did it get all the way over here? Wasn't it around your neck? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, thank goodness, my pendant. It has a lot of sentimental value. May I have it back? Yeah, sure. I came to see the festival. You live in this town, don't you? I feel a little out of place here. Would you mind if I walked around with you for a while? Sure. You're a true gentleman. Oh, by the way, my name is... Uh, 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 what's my name? I don't... Mo Marl. That's a weird name. 
a moral. And you are... Chrono? What a nice name! Pleased to meet you. Now lead on. You have 21 silver points. Want to exchange 10 for 50 gold? Oh, I see. I see what this is. Ah. You want me to get that battle armor, don't you? That's it. I mean... Really. I didn't expect him to be so nice right off the bat. But I see now that it is destiny. That I am the sole protector of the world. Boop, boop. I keep, keep, keep forgetting that... Uh, triangle is menu. It's very confusing. A lot of Japanese games utilize that, but I keep forgetting. I just I want the start to be the menu. I never really got any other button for you know why it would be like that. No time to talk. I'm just sitting down for my lunch. Is that your lunch? Oh, yum! Tastes like chicken. Oh, hehe! <laughs> you're such a pig, Chrono. Huh? No time to talk. I'm just I just ate your lunch. Oh. Uh, no, cat, why are you following me? Keep going if you want to demo Luca's robot battle trainer. Collect silver points if you win. Oh, we've been preparing for it our whole lives. They call me Gato. I have metal joints. Beat me up and earn 15 silver points. Da, 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 da. Why are you pink? That's not very masculine. Ow! 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 Holy shit! A lot of damage. Do you have a health meter? Ow! Stop it! Oh, you have none. Yeah! I lost, you won. Here's 15 points. Now wasn't that fun? Sure. We can't interact with you anymore, Gato. Ah, uh, poor Gato. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is the cat supposed to follow me? I guess it is. Maybe it's just a companion. That's all like... Oh, oh no, it got stuck. Hello? <laughs> you have 26 silver points. No. No. I hate fair. Say, do you know the latest gossip? Yes. Then scram! Let's just say no. Just between us, I heard that the king is distressed over his tomboy of a daughter. Just once, I would like to see how wild she really is. Wiggle eyebrows, eh? Oh, oh, cat, cat, where'd you go? Cat? Did I just kick him? Cat, where did you go? Oh no! Oh, the horror! Where, oh, is that you? No! <laughs> it disappeared. Oh, that's horrible. That's, that's very horrible. Oh, he's back now. That's good. Alright. Wow, where's my cat? Oh. It's a soda guzzling contest. Press the X button as fast as you can. I can do it! I can do it! Not bad, I'll put five silver points on your card. I thank you. You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Chrono? You know, I don't want to hear your remarks. Uh... I am who I am. No need to get on my back about it. 
that music is just scary. After pressing the O button and dashing here and there, I'm pooped. But this dance has just rejuvenated me. Oh. I guess I don't want to participate in that. Wait, no, I do. I do! <laughs> let's, uh, let's do the dance. And then we can, uh, then we'll call it a day. A prehistoric dance, how enchanting. Catchy rhythm, press the triangle. Use the... Dun, 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 dun. Oh god. Oh god, I can't get out of it. Oh god. No. Oh. They won't stop. <laughs> My god, it's an infinite loop! I'm not even pressing anything anymore. Can I? Okay. Oh, 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 okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Let's get out of here! <laughs> that was just scary! I thought I broke the game. Uh, right, okay. Come here, cat! Come here, kitty! Come, come on! Man, look at Chrono's footsteps. He's he's he knows where he wants to go. He's like, yeah, I'm going. I'm a manly man. You brought back my cat. Thank you. Oh, you're so sweet, Chrono. Okay. Can, can I can I save now? Is this a free saving world? Can you save whenever you want in this world? I guess not. Uh, so uh, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment and tune into the next.